If you drop a like on this video in the next 3 seconds, then by Monday, you will no longer be single. Hi guys, if you guys are new to the channel, I'm Thug, I upload daily Red Dead online videos, so if you guys love to watch Red Dead, or just love to watch the game in general, or you want to stay rich on the game, I highly recommend you guys go ahead and subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification. Now today, I will be showing you guys a brand new working solo money glitch that few of my friends and also few of my subscribers work together to find. Now this money glitch is the only work money glitch on Red Dead Online that is solo. Everything else requires a friend to help you out but this one which I'm about to show you guys today is 100% solo and all of you guys watching this video will be able to do. Now before we get into the video I just want to say thank you so much for the amazing support you guys have been giving to the videos. Oh my god the support has been insane. But that's out of the way let's not waste any more time let's get straight into the video. Hope you guys enjoy. Make the streams louder. So to begin with today's video, the reason I'm actually releasing the solo money glitch is just because of the fact you guys listened to me and hit the like goal for the last video. Now the like goal for this video is going to be 241. If we can smash that, then I will give you guys a surprise by the end of this week. Now that's out of the way. First of all, let me explain to you guys what this money glitch is. So if you guys are new to Red Dead and you don't know, you're able to hunt animals and you're able to take the carcasses or take the body and go sell it to the butcher. Well, what this glitch is going to allow you guys to do is once you kill a really really expensive animal imagine you killed a cougar or a panther when you actually go ahead and sell them that's it you get $14 or whatever you're supposed to make that's it well what this glitch is going to allow you guys to do is to dupe the carcasses so you can just dupe the body like three times go sell all of them and make yourself the money now you guys are like sky what would be the best animal to use for this glitch well I would recommend using a panther because the panther carcass actually goes for $14. If you do want to hunt for a panther, then make your way to this location, which is south of Rhodes. So just fast travel to Rhodes and then make your way to this location, which is really close to the river. Once you actually arrive at that specific location, so just put a waypoint, get on your horse and make your way there. Once you guys arrive there, just slowly maneuver around the location. You guys will see that the panther will spawn and it will be on your mini map. As soon as you see the red dot, just go ahead and kill the panther. Also, I highly recommend using a bow or a sniper rifle because that will make it so much easier and you guys will also get a good carcass of the panther. Now remember one thing, the better the carcass, the more money you will be making. Just because of the fact, imagine you have a 3 star rated carcass that goes for $14 compared to 2 star rated one that goes for $8 and the 1 star rated one goes for like $5. So when you dupe it, you will be making $5 every time and the other one you will be making $14 every time. So just make sure you keep the carcass quality as high as you possibly can. Now once you guys have hunted for a panther or a cougar, it's really up to you, it doesn't really matter. Now in the gameplay you guys will be like sky why the heck did you shoot the panther so many times well if you pay attention to the gameplay the gameplay was extremely laggy or the game was extremely laggy and i couldn't tell if the panther was dead or not and i ended up shooting it so many times that it became a one star rated i was okay with it because i had to get this video out for you guys but make sure you go for a three star rated cougar or a panther now once you guys have collected an expensive carcass what you guys need to do is go ahead and put it on the back of your horse and make your your way to a location which is a confined space so what i mean by that is a closed area now, I will show you guys the location at Rhodes, but if you guys hunt at Valentine, then there is also a place in Valentine, there's a closed barn. You can go inside of it and put your horse inside the barn, and then you can just stand there and your horse will be stuck. So literally, at this point, all you're trying to do is you're trying to look for a location where your horse would be stuck and you will be able to hold it there. Now, if you guys want to go to the same location I do in the gameplay, just make your way to Rhodes and then make your way to the specific location, which is really close to the post office so it's just on the other side. Now, once you guys arrived at the closed area, all you guys got to do is go ahead and put your horse in a closed area and stand there so your horse cannot run away. Simple as that. You can literally do this at any spot you possibly find. Just make sure it's a place that you can actually block your horse from running away. Now, in the gameplay, I'll be using this location. So you just need to park your horse or leave your horse at a location so the horse can't run away. Then block off his parts so he doesn't run away for sure and make sure that the cougar or the panther is on the back of the horse. And at this point, once you have parked it there, you just need to hold L2 or LT on Xbox to get the menu. 
that allows you to flee the horse so all you need to do is just hold l2 or lt get the option press circle or b to flee the horse what flee the horse means is the horse will just try to run away now while the horse is trying to run away what you need to do is take the cougar off the back of the horse put it back on now once you put it back on you need to hold the horse do not let it run away just hold the horse until you possibly can you just want the horse to drop the cougar or the panther before it goes away now this is something that might happen to you guys when you do it for the first time so when you do the glitch for the first time the cougar or the panther might just despawn if that happens just let your horse run away and then call it back by whistling and you guys will notice that a cougar or a panther will be on the back of the horse this only happens when you do the glitch first time when you do it the second third every single time the glitch is going to work now as you guys can see we have it set up again so the horse is at a location where it can't run away very quickly then just block off the path so it does not run away then hold L2 or LT flee the horse soon as you flee the horse you need to go ahead and pick up the panther put it back on the back of the horse and you need to hold the horse until it drops the panther from the back once it drops it you can just let it run away and once it runs away and you guys call it back in you guys will notice that you have a cougar or a panther right in front of you and secondly there is one more on the back of your horse now as you guys can see when i was doing the glitch some kid just came out of nowhere and shoots me but it doesn't matter when i went back to the location you guys will see that i already have had a duplicated copy now this guy was completely psycho so he just went ahead and burned the carcass and i'm like wait what the heck is wrong with this kid but as you guys can see this is the duplicated carcass and there was another carcass on the back of my horse now i'm going to do the glitch one more time just to show you guys that the glitch does work but this guy just kept killing me so you guys just have to stick through it so for the final go as you guys can see i have my horse parked up one more time this time i'm gonna go ahead and hold l2 or lt to flee the horse when i flee the horse i need to take the cougar or the panther off put it back on make sure that the horse does not run away wait for it to actually drop the cougar or the panther off the back of it and once it drops it then you can just let it go away and then you guys will notice that you have a body on the ground and when you call your horse, there will be another body on the back of your horse and you will be able to sell both of them and make yourself the money. Now, I know in the gameplay it seems like this is so many hard steps, but trust me, it's really simple. You just need to get a horse that has a cougar or the panther on the back of it. Then you need to go to a location where it is a confined place and then you need to make sure that the horse is blocked off. And while the horse is blocked off, you just need to flee the horse, put the cougar on your shoulder, put it back on. And once you put it back on, just make sure sure you hold the horse until it drops it then let it go away and when you call it you guys will notice that there will be a second body on the back of the horse that's literally it this glitch is really really easy try it out for yourself and then you guys will come back to this video and drop a like on it now if you guys haven't already make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to the channel also go ahead and share this video out with all your friends and let them know like there is super easy solo money glitch working right now because i know everyone's focusing on the duo money glitch you know the one that you do with your friend but trust me this one's even easier as you guys can see there is two cougars at this point but the guy just kept blowing everything up so it was super super annoying but other than that thank you so much for watching this video today hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like on it if you're new to the channel i highly recommend you guys subscribe and turn on your notification but other than that have a great day ahead and i will see you guys in the next one i'm out peace